Camera number 246 of 365 is the Canon AE-1 program. I've waited a long time to acquire one of these. Uh, every time I seem to see them, they either went for ridiculous sums of money or they were broken. But uh, finally, the waiting has uh, been worth it and uh, has rewarded me with the uh, not only the body, but uh, a 1.8 uh, lens, not this one, the silver tipped nosed one, but the, the plastic one. And also uh, the Power Winder, the Power Winder A2, which uh, takes four AA batteries. And uh, the Canon itself requires a battery to operate, and we get to the battery by taking the sports grip off, which then allows us to see the battery compartment. It's a single. 4LR44 battery, 6 volts, and then uh, close the door and put the sports back on, but we won't. It takes too much time. So, looking through the uh, general features of the camera, it has uh, three exposure modes which we'll go through, but uh, let's just run through um, the, uh, the camera's uh, basic functions. So, we take a, a lens off by uh, uh, taking the breech mount FD lens. Uh, it does take FL lenses uh, which have to be stopped down and this is what this little mechanism here is uh, is used for, the stop down lever. Uh, and then we have uh, a preview and uh, then an auto exposure lock button, a flash sync port and uh, there is a, a sync port also uh, no, it's not a sync port, it's a cable release for the A2 uh, winder, which is screwed on via this, uh, this screw here. Uh, it does feature the little button that allows us to uh, unlock the film advance so that we can then rewind our film. So although it has uh, the power winder, the power winder only um, advances the film. It doesn't uh, help to rewind at all. That's done manually by um, with the rewind crank. Uh, our film speeds are around the film rewind crank as well, which is uh, is locked via this little button here. So we uh, just unlock it and then we can rotate the dial. We have a battery test. Don't know whether you can hear that. Beeps that. Uh, indicate the battery is OK. And then we have uh, our dial which allows us to choose from the first mode which is program mode. So let's just put the lens back on and then we can run through the programs. The first program is uh, program mode if you like, uh, auto program mode where the camera makes all the decisions. Sorry I'm not putting it on pr correctly. Oops, sorry. Sorry about that. I'm clearly not putting it on correctly. There we go. The lens will go on eventually. Sorry about that. This is uh, real world photography. There we go. Right, excellent. Okay, so that demonstrates, uh, which I've done of course purposely, so to, to, you have to be careful how you put uh, the lens on. So, with the lens set to A, if it's uh, an FD lens, or on this occasion it's got a little green dot, that's uh, A mode, and the camera is set to program mode, then the camera is set to full auto exposure point and shoot mode effectively. Um, if we take the camera off program mode but leave the lens on auto mode, we now have a shutter priority program mode. Let's get that correct. And uh, what that means basically is that uh, when we set our shutter speed, the camera responds by setting the correct aperture. Uh, the last mode is if we take the lens off auto mode, and now we have a fully metered manual mode. And when we look through the viewfinder, on all three modes, we just get our aperture uh, reading. So uh, no shutter speed, just uh, our aperture along the right hand side here and an indication whether it's in program or whether it's in manual mode. 
Okay, uh, we have uh, our film counter, and then we have uh, our on and off switch, our lock button, and then a self timer. Let's just see if we can activate that. Let's put the motor wind on. Let's do that again. Okay, so there's a sample of the uh, sound. Unfortunately, the camera does suffer from the uh, Canon squeak. Uh, whether I do anything about it or not, I'm not quite sure at this moment. The camera works. Uh, the exposure is slightly out. Uh, at first, I thought it was completely out, um, but uh, it's just out by maybe a stop with uh, when compared to using a handheld meter. And then uh, just finally, the uh, power winder has uh, an on, a single or a continuous release button and then of course our film memo. So there we go, I'm very pleased to finally have acquired uh, the Canon AE-1 program and uh, that has been camera number 246 of 365. Uh, an auto exposure, or app, sorry, expo an aperture, no, it's not an aperture at all, it's a shutter. A shutter.